Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to let you know that if you are using the Vivaldi web browser for desktop and are also wanting to maybe in the future download the browser and you are running Windows 10 and Windows 11, then just to let you know that in a recent tweet over on Twitter, Vivaldi has announced, and I'm quoting, that we've seen the requests and now the Vivaldi browser is available on the Microsoft Store. We're happy to see the increased availability for our users. So um, if you are running Windows 10, Windows 11, and you want to download the browser, there's another way now to download Vivaldi. So previously you had to head over to Vivaldi's website, where now if you head over to the MS uh, Store, you just um, enter Vivaldi in the search, as many of you would know, and there we go, Vivaldi browser, now available to install by clicking on that link, and you can download that now onto Windows 10 and Windows 11, which I think is a nice move, because now Vivaldi joins a couple of other web browsers, which are also available from the Microsoft Store. And just to mention a couple of these, um, we get Firefox, um, which is available. We get Oprah and Edge. And Oprah and Edge, like Vivaldi, as many of you would know, are also Chromium-based web browsers. So Vivaldi now um, has also joined the list of browsers available to download on both Windows 10 and Windows 11 from the Microsoft Store. Now, Vivaldi, uh, just to do a quick recap, um, Vivaldi is um, a browser that's packed with a lot of features. Um, I do post... Um, videos and we do um, look at updates regarding Vivaldi on the channel and uh, um, the most recent update to Vivaldi was to version 6 which brought a whole lot of new features and I'll leave a link to that video down below if you would be interested and one of the main key highlights for version 6 um, the version 6 upgrade was this new workspaces feature which I did cover uh, in that video so just letting you know about that but um, if you are wanting to download Vivaldi as mentioned you now have another option and it's available now to download and install from the Microsoft Store. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.